Hey, how's it going, guys? It's your old pal Slick Wallington back with another Slick's Pick retro video game review, and this time it's episode 6 of my top 10 Atari 5200 games. This one is Keystone Capers, copyright 1983 and 84 by Activision, one of the big names back in the day. Um, I loved the commercial for this one back in the day, and I saw it around, but I never owned it. So as an adult, I've been playing it, and it's a pretty fun game. Basic concept. That little blue blob there in the middle is your uh, uh, officer, your police officer. And it's kind of a weird game because it's based on a movie that came out in, like, I want to say, like, 19-teens, maybe 1920s. Um, so the goal is you've got to run down the criminal... Harry Hoodlum, I think his name was. Harry Hooligan. So you just take off. See, he's got his little billy club there. You press the button to jump. You can collect that. I got 200 points for collecting that briefcase. And there he goes. There was the bad guy. That SW stands for the name of this warehouse. And see, you just have to kind of time the jumps to clear that. Now, when you get to the end of the row, you've got the little escalator. You run up, and then you've got to go back. You can take the elevator in the middle, but... You can't really control where the elevator goes, so that's kind of like a dicey proposition. The alternate, of course, is to run. Now, you don't want to hit too many obstacles because it slows you down and it also takes time off the clock. Um, it's You're going to need that time to catch him because they give him a generous head start, but fortunately he has to run basically the same route that we do in terms of uh, running right to left here so here we go and we got him and that's level one so now we're on to level two and we're going to see they're going to add a few more obstacles for us oh the door just closed so oops I think it takes five off your clock and slowed me down just a tidge I didn't see it though Fortunately, ouch, I hit the radiator, whatever that is, oh man. We can still get him, we can still get him. Can't afford to hit anything else though. Ten seconds. Jump the radiator. Oh, he's right there. Can we get him? Got him. Level 3. So it's a pretty basic concept, but it's fun. You know, like a lot of the early Activision games, they just had some nice colorful graphics and nice, like, you've got like your score up there, you've got all your guys, you got the little radar on the bottom there that shows the thing. I see that shopping cart there. Those will also repeat, so you have to kind of be careful because all of these things will re... Oh, crap. So we don't get far enough, another one will come out. There he goes. But usually if you keep your foot on the gas, or your thumb on the stick, I should say. Let's go get him, boys. Got him. Ten grand, nice. Okay, so we start out with about 50 seconds. Oh, crap. You see that plane up there, too? We're going to have to duck that, so we have to stop for a second. Oh, and then uh, repeat it. Hmm. Okay. Back the other way. Oops. I would say it's more important to not hit anything than it is to keep running because you lose. There we go. See, you lose about a second there, maybe doing it that way. But it's better than losing five. So let's see if we can get this guy. There. Got 
Got him. Okay, so now we're on level five. Holy crap! That's a high bouncing tomato. <laughs> Oh, man, right in the noggin. He's already up a level. Oh, shoot. I lost a lot for that one. I lost like 10 seconds. Oh, man. I think this might be the end of the day for us this time. Let's see if we can get... Can I get in there? Yes. Get him. Got him. Level six. Oh. oh I got one more shot. Oh, crap. Hey, I got him. Oh, I got a free guy, too. Level 7. Oh, I can't get under. I thought I could run right underneath him. That was wrong. That was worth a shot. Oh. Come on, baby. Oh, how did he go back down? That's some skullduggery right there. Anyway, so that's Keystone Capers for the Atari 5200, which is now, I believe, number six out of my top ten. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe and check us out again next time when we, when we play another top ten Atari 5200 game. So thanks. I'll talk to you later.